Statistics available to the police hospitals show that four police personnel committed suicide in 2017. Out of the number, three used firearm, whereas the fourth took his own life by hanging. A similar number was recorded last year. Already one police officer has taken his own life this year using firearm. These cases, according to the police hospital, were as a result of poor management of stress and other mental disorders. We also have cases of depression, we have cases of post-traumatic stress disorder, and then suicide attempts. 108 police personnel were diagnosed with stress and mental-related complications last year. 60% of these cases are related to alcohol. According to ASP Foster Naniwoto, the long hours of work coupled with exposure to dead bodies and sometimes shooting at criminals push most personnel into alcohol usage. When they go through those stressful situations, they want a relief for that. And the relief that is readily available because alcohol is not uh, illegal in the country. And it is that thing that gives that temporary relief. They fall on it but then the long-term effect is devastating for them. In a bid to reduce the danger posed to personnel, the Accra Regional Police Command has begun stress management sensitization program. With the theme, building a resilient, healthy lifestyle for effective policing, we need our police officers to be sound, to be able to give us expectation we all expect from them. The program will be rotated in order to get all personnel to participate.